Hey Kirsten, it is January 21st and first thing I have to show you is I just got this in the mail. It's the Men of YouTube calendar I was talking about um, that they made for the Project for Awesome and it's got some pretty awesome photos in it. March is one of my favorites with uh, Hank and John Green and what else? July. I love July. I love Tyler Oakley. He is amazing. You should check it out. Uh, and who else? Oh, the last one. Creeper Santa Michael Aranda and Charlie McDonald. Okay, so I'm a little obsessed with this calendar. I'm so happy I donated to Project for Awesome, not only because I got to help some awesome causes, but because this calendar is worth like a million dollars to me. So awesome. So anyway, um, to get things, some things out of the way, uh, first thing, order of business is yes, it's going to be a Monday, Wednesday, Friday schedule. I figured that'd just be easiest. Um, it makes it so it's only one day less for each of us, and I think it would just get confusing if we did like Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then like Tuesday, Thursday, especially with the weekend. I mean, if there's four days in between videos, both of us are going to forget, and it's just going to be all kinds of punishments all around. As far as Castle goes, um, I was really interested in the fact that w whatever Castle's um, ex-wife's name was uh, said that we don't really know a whole lot about Castle, even though we, we seem to know a whole lot about uh, Beckett. And I thought that was a really interesting point, both towards like Beckett being involved with her and us as an audience, is we haven't heard much about Castle, and I'm hoping that means that we'll get to hear more about him really soon because I want to know. Also, the People's Choice Awards was on s Friday, Wednesday, I believe. It was just like fangirling all over the place because Jared and Jensen were there and they were on stage with Adam Levine and then Shamar Moore came on and I was just like, oh gosh, so many hot guys. Yeah, that was really cool. And um, what else? Oh, we won the People's Choice Award. Yeah, I want a People's Choice Award because I am a member of the Supernatural family and we won for best, uh, or like, favorite TV show, community thing. And yeah, I'm just so proud of like all my Supernatural brethren and happy that we won. Hmm. And yeah, there was a couple like awards that I was just like, why did they win? Hunger Games like took like all the awards. Like, all of them. In other news, one of my favorite authors from middle school is coming up with a book series in like July and I'm so excited. I went, me and my friend uh, Sarah, we went to Second and Charles yesterday and I exchanged some books and got uh, quite a bit of credit money and I got pretty much all of the books that she had wrote, that they had there, um, which was only like two. But still, um, I'm going to reread those because I love them so much and I have so many books I need to read. One last thing I wanted to mention before I completely forget, congratulations on finishing Fireflies. I am so excited for you. I can't wait to actually read it all. And yeah, I hope editing goes smoothly and maybe hopefully you'll get it published. I I'm excited. Yeah. Um, yeah, because I mean, like, if I'm working in a library and by the time then you have a book published, I can be like, hey, my friend wrote this book, you should read it. So yeah, 